Dennis DeYoung did not acknowledge the 45-year anniversary of Pieces of Eight from Styx. This is the Rock and Roll Weatherman. My name is Sean Morrison, a landmark album from Styx that produced hits such as Blue Collar Man, you know, Renegade Sing for the Day, which hits that was sung by Tommy Shaw. Of course, we had Great White Hope from James Young on there. We also had um, Lord of the Ring from there, from James Young. And, of course, don't forget Dennis DeYoung's songs like I'm Okay and um, Queen of Spades, which is a great freaking song. If you're not subscribed to the Sean Morrison you need the channel, please do so. Everyone else has to subscribe. We thank you much for the continued love, honor, and support. It's really appreciated. You know where to go for a small donation. Sean Morris Enterprises via PayPal. So, friends, why didn't Dennis DeYoung acknowledge the 35-year anniversary? I'm sorry, the 45-year anniversary of the six album, Pieces of Eight. Could it be that he was upset he didn't have a major hit on the album? What are your thoughts? Shame, shame, shame.